I think I had one too many cans of grape soda yesterday. Oh, what's that? This isn't a rock. It's an armatorin. I'll drop my shadow leeches on it and turn it into a shadow matorin. Ha 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 XD. Special effects. Dog don't care. Ah oh, yes, my loyal Shadow Matoran, you will follow my every command. Thaw gonna make you die. What? No. <laughs> Meanwhile, at Molten Man's base. Mr. Molten Man, sir. What do you want, Vastus? I saw this weird creature on the news that ate the entire continent of Asia. And why are you telling me this? You might be able to capture this creature and use it to carry out your plans. Thog, don't care. Don't move, creature. Well, sir, what do you think? This demon will make a very nice soldier. Come on, let's go. Thaw, I'm gonna make you die. What? Thaw, I'm mad now. What the heck? Ale stopped him, Molten Man. Yeah. Thaw, I'm gonna kill you bad. What you gonna do now, poopy diaper? How did my bullets not penetrate you? Don't you know, Thog had the death vaccine. But you were just born today. Thog don't care. Any last words that Thog don't care about? Wait, wait, wait. I, I, I can change. Don't, don't kill me and my henchmen, please. Fine. Since Thog in a good mood today, Thog not gonna kill you. But the next time you mess with Thog, you won't get out of it alive. Yeah, yes, Thog. We, we won't. Come on, boys, let's skedaddle. And so... Thog would live peacefully until he was once again attacked by Molten Man in the first Thog movie. And I guess you couldn't tell this is a prequel to Thog vs. Molten Man the movie, but I'm just going to call it Thog 5 because I want to. So yeah.